Let's go over the anaconda choke. First off, when I'm in turtle, I want to be in the north-south turtle position where my head is close to my partner's head, not hip to hip. If they don't hand fight, I always sit back for guillotines. This is very crucial that I fall to the side and throw my leg over the back and I hunt for that guillotine. My setup for the anaconda comes from them defending the guillotine so their elbows get really close together while they defend and I take a gable grip on the outside. For the anaconda, my arm goes in at the neck and out of the armpit. For the darts, I'm hip to hip and my arm goes in at the armpit and out of the neck. So we're here in at the neck, out of the armpit. I do a gable grip and I need to try to pull his elbow down and across his body, across his chest. So I need to get my arms a little bit lower on the arm, down towards their elbow. And then I'm gonna get on my tiptoes and I'm gonna circle towards their head. As they give me a little resistance, I can roll on through. And from here, I'm pulling my hands down towards my stomach and I'm using my leg to trap their elbow. From there, we lock to our bicep and we walk and squeeze. So again, we're here in turtle, we go for the guillotine, they defend, the elbows are close, so I go gable grip, I get on my tiptoes and I start circling away, and now I roll on through. Once we're here, I don't wanna to try to lace to my elbow early because some people are really good at opening that elbow up, flaring their elbow to the side, and then it breaks your grip. So I keep my gable grip, I use my leg to trap their elbow, calf curling, and now we lock to our bicep, and now we squeeze and walk. We're walking and crushing and crimping their head into our stomach. Again, we threaten the guillotine, we go for our gable grip on the outside, we get on our toes, we walk towards the head, and then we roll the other direction. Here, let's say our opponent beats us to the punch. They open up their elbow and it breaks our gable grip. I'm gonna take the back of my hand and place it on their chest. My thumb's gonna be wedged underneath their jaw. Back of my hand, I take an underhook with the far arm now and I bridge on my shoulders and I come all the way up to side control and we have a one-handed guillotine for the finish. One more time on this sequence. We gable grip, we tripod up, we drive, and we circle, and now we roll on through. Once we have them here, we go for our anaconda. It fails because they open up their elbow. Immediately at the same time, I shoot for my underhook and the back of my hand posting on their chest. I bridge to allow their head to go under my armpit as I run all the way up to side control, and now we drive into our partner and pull our elbow behind our back for an easy finish. I don't wanna sit back, I wanna compress the pressure and pull my elbow behind my back for that choke. Again guys, this is a request video. Till next time, let's get it.